can strainer right here. I love this product to drain the corn. And if I was using it in a tuna can, I would use it this direction. It's like a little mini colander. So it's great for a lot of other things too. Um, I use it in the sink sometimes on my garbage disposal side so that I don't lose things down the um, garbage disposal, but I can actually run the water down. And so it works nice for that as well. Again, we're just going to continue making our little stripes right here. And just going to have little layers. This is such a pretty salad. We have avocado and chicken and tomatoes. We're going to have two different kinds of dressing. We're going to have a ranch dressing where we put about half, um, half ranch dressing and half um, salsa. And then we're going to do a green goddess avocado dressing as well. We're going to make that in the manual food processor. So then I'm going to use the egg slicer to slice the olives. And you can buy um, olives already sliced, but you can get a big can of olives for the same price as the sliced olives, and you get a lot more that way. And we're just going to um, just put them in the egg slicer. And again, we're just going to make that little row. I don't put the black beans in the olives. And the nice thing about it is if people don't like olives, they can just pick around them when they're serving their salads. I jokingly say that olives and mushrooms and bell peppers um, are cootie foods. And that, that a lot of people don't like coconut and olives. And so when you put them out like this, people can avoid them if they don't like them. But then there are a lot of us who think they're and so we're really going to have a nice salad and we have all this variety of foods. Now, what else can you do with the egg slicer? Well, first off, you can slice eggs. But if you peel kiwi and you put it in here, you can do perfectly sliced kiwi, mushrooms, strawberries. And so it's really handy if you ever, after years of use, you've stretched out your wires, you can just replace the wires off of the Pampered Chef replacement parts. And, you know, just a wonderful product um, that you can use for multiple different things. So we've got that almost done. So there's a lot of olives this way. There we go. And I'd be using gloves if I was doing um, a show and I was touching the food like this. I would use gloves. But because I'm making this for my family, they get mom's special touch.